Hello there, everybody. Welcome back. Uh, for you guys, you probably just finished up watching our zombie apocalypse there with Dr. Ned or Zadora. The undead a planet Zed, that Ned, wants new, only him. peace and prosperity. Today, I decided, as I mentioned you are late. before, I was we thinking about what quests I wanted to do next, for my own but I decided and therefore you must that we're going to be doing the T-Bone Junction he knows with where uh, to find General Mox or Fort Mox or Don't whatever they call it here. With your hands again. Whatever they want to call it. The short answer is, this is what we're doing. It does have a mission I wanted to end my series on, but I'm not going to lie to you guys. I don't know if I have the patience to wait that long because I really want to do it. So we're not going to end the series with it, but we're going to play through. And we're just going to keep on trucking. But this is my favorite DLC of the, well, technically four. You're in T-Bone Junction in like a weird doll location area. Shit in me, Paul. Didn't think I'd ever see your dumb ass again. Surely open the vault. Hey, that steel chick, check her clothes off yet? Not. I'm gonna need details though. Scooter. Get you one. I act all casual like when I say this. I'm a speaking code, so I hope you have the mental capacity to follow. Your lady friend told me to send you to Moxie's place when you stop by. Huh, <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. Hey, you ain't getting nowhere without wheels, boy. And maybe so. girl. I've been cooking up something new, but I ain't finished the booster system yet. Need a bit of secret sauce. This is where you build that new, uh, build like a new truck or something. But for the most part, I'm not looking for anything, uh, Oh, here's the storage deck upgrades. Hello, Traveler! There are new missions available on the T-Bone Junction Bounty Board! So now I have all of the, uh... Whatever it's called. This one looks way cooler. Go for your way. Have all these. Uh, we're not gonna use. Well, we might use that one because it has that team rare finds on it. We gotta find parts for this new unit. Alright, hey, what I'm gonna unit. need is an X372 supercharger, but not the 373. There's recall this, I think, on that is thing, the I'm gonna count people burning alive and shit. Also, a big old tank of nitrous and one of them fancy exhaust do. booger things. I don't even know what it does, man! Oh, and side note, there is an achievement. I don't believe it's a quest, it's just an achievement. There's these, like, midgets that are in these certain chests. Oh, smoking Jesus titty cinnamon, that is a monster! That's gonna be this is something later, I think. I think there's one of the midget guys down here. Maybe it's in that room. No, oh, it's in here. Oh. The only reason I remember this is because it took me forever the first time I ever did it to figure out where they was to realize there's a chest down here you was hidden. And I think it's in this room. And you have to do a quest to open that door. I think. But you have to like open every chest. Whoa. That might be interesting. Oh, the door's open now. You have to hit the button to open the door. I think it's this one. Oh, yeah. Seems meat pops a 
Eagle. He's level 61. Jesus. <laughs> I call the getting stronger oh, yeah. by the minute. So we killed one of them. Now there's three other ones scattered throughout this game. Ooh. That's me. Oh, I have spinning nipples. It's unusual. Okay, let's keep moving. I wanted to get that before I forgot about that, because I knew it was there. That's the only one I actually remember where it is. I think there's one when we get closer to, like, the one of the end missions in the f first part of the game. I can't really explain it, because I don't want to give away too much details yet. But I vaguely remember some of this. But the only thing I don't remember is if you guys can see my achievements. Or not. Because I found out that I have not finished some of the playthrough on this. I don't mean by that I finished it on the original Xbox game. But I never actually finished it. Remastered. I did not do simply, but not remastered. Omega sends you order has been issued for you. There will be five teams assembled to guarantee the objective is successful. That was the first. The Omegas are relentless and highly trained. The elites, elite. The el well, shoot, looks like the passenger seat's no, gonna have to go bye-bye to here's fit the deal, that though, bad boy in this. there. I'll get to work on that right, right now. Right now, I never got to level 61 on the remastered game like we're playing right now. So as far as this physical game cop is concerned, this is new. I haven't played this since Xbox 360, so everything that I'm remembering is from them. Why can't I buy this? Welcome to hell. Hello. Let me know if there is anything I can do for you. Let's get on this. You just cool your titties, buddy. Hey, you seen my gun? I can give you my gun if you want. I can always tell you the resourceful type. Bring him on back and we'll get you rolling. If you need healing, step right up. I wouldn't mind using that uh, rare mod increase. Just because it'll help me find like better, more potent stuff. Atlas believes in customer service above all else. Though all sales are final. All sales are final. Oh, there's this thing. This is a quest or something, I think. Hey, one of them crimson bucket sluts put a number on my hand trying to get information on your secret lady friend. Now, I didn't tell him nothing, but I can't install anything right now. Uh, give me a hand getting the stuff in. Hello, Marcos here. I've got an opportunity for you. Come bet you see me at my place in T-Bone Junction. By the way, I'm still uh, pissed about how many headshots I had to get for that stupid zombies challenge. God, was that horrible. But I'll do it just for the nostalgia. Are you hanging with Moxie to join the Fathoms? <laughs> Grab one of those monsters we just finished and get your ass moving. Let's trick out your ride. Let's trick out your ride. Ooh, that's the one that's got the first time. We'll talk to Marcus and see what he's got. I don't understand why my shield isn't recharged. How can I help you? Okay, so the core collections. So this one is good to have on right now. Because this is like one of the progressive ones where it takes time. So as far as those go. There's nothing to get excited about other than activate it and then you just get it as you go. Hey Scooter, 
here. Just a heads up, those Crimson D-Bags set up some roadblocks in the highway. Just get your murder on and we'll pretend nobody saw nothing. Okay. The Crimson Tollway. Now we have to go find, uh... Well, Moxie's red light's where we're going. What's cool is I'm pretty over leveled compared to some of these guys right now. So these quests, for the most part, should be easier than had I tried this the first time. Because I think this is the uh, bonus mission that I added the extra on the Junction Bounty Board. I should make It is what it is. I like the heat seeking option. For the most part, I don't think there's really going to be any, uh, much by way of good l I just said it. Holy crap. I'm going to pick up that gun, huh? Are you kidding me? Chest, dude, that was like clean. I didn't even see what it was, I just saw it was like a. Well, it's got slightly lower fire rate, smaller mag, but it's more accurate with way more damage. It's a doll based combat raven, whatever that means. Way more damage, similar mag size, slightly lower fire rate. Let's see how it looks. I can live with this. The reload speed's nice. I literally just said I don't know if we're gonna find new guns, and I just found two replacements. That's funny. That's a core, by the way. I just accidentally drove over it. You have to pick up a whole bunch of them. Oh, yeah. That's way too easy. And I think all of them drop cores. And depending on if they're the regular guy or like an elite one or whatever, that tells you what core they drop. I have to pick up a whole bunch of them. The drawback is I have to open all these in case I find them. Oh, I may not worry about finding a midget right now. Maybe I will, I haven't decided yet. <laughs> this is also why it's nice to have a really high set machine gun proficiency. Basically, I can do whatever I want.
I won't worry about opening chests. I'm not overly concerned right now. Badass shock trooper. Basically, let it happen. <sighs> I tried blowing it up thinking it would blow up, and then when it didn't, I'm like, oh, I guess it won't. That's just me being dumb. The green ones are really nice, they're more speed cars, so you run quicker. barely do any damage to me. Where I get the kill and then the shield regens instantly. They actually can damage me. That's funny. Actually, because I have, uh, because I'm really over leveled, I'm gonna turn this class mod on. Because I get the team rare find. I don't need the regen on right now, and I can always flip flop them. Ooh, a Crimson Lance chest. Legendary class mods. I don't remember how you get them though. General Knox. All right, this is General Knox. I don't, uh, really want to be here. This planet smells like hemorrhoids rapidly. I sent steel to this planet to take care of this little problem, and also because it seriously hurt her. She talks all the time. And hello, have you met our friend the sun? So, I guess, thanks for turning her into a meat kebab. Also, I'm gonna kill you and stuff. Cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. Okay. Apparently my car doesn't want to flip over. I also have team regen, or uh, team regen. Yeah, team regen. Skill regens. Basically my cooldown's a lot quicker. I'll get to use my phase walk abilities more, so that way I don't have to deal with the entertainment. Hey, lads, are the best armed mercs out there. You need something better. This one's by far better. Which is ironic.
you about ready to get rolling. Let's go see if we can't meet up with Mad Moxie. <laughs> or whatever. Is it a Mad Moxie? Moxie's red light. And yes, she is a prostitute. For those wondering. She a hooker. Hey, but just she a quick mad note about mama. Moxie in the event you ain't met her. She got a peculiar streak in her. Loves the limelight, but she ain't as sketchy as she appears know. to be on stage. Uh, I almost forgot. She's my mom. So you treat her right, or I'll bury you where I buried Lucky. Yeah, I killed him. Don't act all surprised. I told you I was gonna do it. I bet. Let's figure out how to get up to Matt Moxie's here. I think it's this way. Interestingly enough, they absolutely wrecked my vehicles. They didn't jack the main. Constitution ring in the middle of a fucking desert on a highway. That is interesting. What the? That damage falls too much there. Right now I'm just looking for uh, pretty much gold stuff to replace my current stuff. Moxie! Hey, Mama. Mr. Shank, is that you? If it's you, I already told you your money is no good. Oh, it's you. You won't need your money here. Tiger Grow. Oh, yeah. Well, hello. There. There's Mommy. Excuse the mess, but a good kidnapping is never clean. 
Shank busted in and took Miss Athena for a little ride. You should have seen the fight she put up. That kitty has claws! Hey, Mommy. Mr. Shank is after the chunk of change that Atlas has put on Athena's pretty little face. If you want him, you'll need to do some fancy driving. Luckily, I'm just the person to help with that. Mm -hmm. Are you ready to rescue the princess? I think you can handle it. Head out to the prison. You're looking for an outcropping. Flashlight gun shoot more lightning than the National Beating Competitor. Always something new. I wonder if she has anything in here. It's just literally just a place to pick up a quest. Come on in out of the dust. Moxie is mama. Hey there! Mama said you'll be needing the racer for one of your uh, adventures. I've uploaded the Digistruct to the Catch a Ride system. You should be able to grab one whenever you want. Hey, I'd be careful though. Compared to the monster, that thing might as well be a box of gravy with wheels. Oh, I might have myself get the core. Speed run, baby. And yes, I am gonna take the regular speed racer. Racer is a little something I had my Scooby Kittens whip up for me. Got the extra junk in her trunk you'll need to storm the castle. Just a little bit quicker is all. The drawback with this DLC is you can't. Oh my god. You can't fast travel back and forth. You basically have to... Oh my god. Literally can't even turn. You basically have to... Uh, literally drive across the map. This thing is like... Oh my god. We're gonna go hit up, up the bounty board too. Yes, this thing is a lot quicker. Like it's probably 20% faster than the other speeder that we had before. Like in the non-DLC. Drawback is it's just like can't turn. Like flip it. It's more designed for straight line speed. Basically, dragster. That's the best way to compare it. It's a lot nicer for when you have to go back and forth when you have the speedy car. Hit the bunny board up. Just a lot of run. That's what I was talking about. Very sporadic with its uh, handling. Hello, Traveler! There are new missions available on the T-Bone Junction Bounty Board. Wow! You're not dead? 
What I do find funny is it literally is asking me to do one quest, and it keeps repeating, and it's like, oh, there's a new mission available. Last one was underneath. So you cheat that a little bit. That's it? You're not dead. Oh. You're not dead? No, I'm not claptrap. Thanks for having faith in me. Now this way there's a lot of fiddle farting around. I think you have to do like two of them. Lance invasion things. Plus there's like an extra catwalk or something. Now, why am I risking my neck for you? First off, I think you're cute. Second, Atlas occupation of Pandora has put a real pinch on my business. When you guys started riling things up on this rock, more people came through my joint in a night than booze went through my second husband's liver. Now, the Lance control of the highway is shutting me down in a hurry. That's where you and your chica come in. Me and my chica? Hell yeah. Midgetville? Oh yeah. If it's called Midgetville, that's gonna be good stuff. Now they're level 50. I just gotta notice we gotta pick them cars up. Them count, baby. so tanky.
Well, that's just awesome. I already That's what I thought, boy. Get your ass up out of here. I ain't playing. Big chest. I like these. These are good chests. That's no good. No good. No good. Just playing around in the better loot drop if I ain't getting nothing better. So drunk. Those Crimson Lance chests are like way better. Here's the other roadblock, I think. Or one of them. Where's that probe? Yeah, you got a wreck, nerd. Because before this thing was really clapping them, right now it's like taking more bullets than I expected. I don't know if you guys noticed that too or not. It's like crazy. Oh, yeah, that's where I have to go on with this. Then there's jetpack dudes. I do see a problem with this sub, uh, or at the very least not having that one mod on. I like the submachine gun ammo regen. That was just nice. But I do miss that. I just saw some dude spawn up here.
Bon, ça. could try using a different gun. We don't really use anything but subs. Let's try this one. This is the new AR. They don't look bad. Not my bag. Oh, the headshots. That thing's cracked. if I want to run the other sub anyway. Just because from that ammo standpoint, I'm not even the sub but the mod I mean. Of course from the ammo standpoint, it'd be nice to not have to worry about finding ammo at all. But... Alright, of course, the beast at this point. Enough walking. Chemical Trooper. myself from the thing blowing up and then I just like survived it oh I know why I'm so much because I don't have that mod on that Duh. You know what? I'm just gonna put it back on. If I find a bunch of chests or some good chests, I would consider putting it back on. I wonder why this feels like it's doing all this damage. Oh yeah. I completely forgot about the sub damage.
regen. Honestly, I don't know why I have bones I have anyway. I don't use them. Fire sniper ain't bad. figure out how to break into this prison. Locked down palace. What an interesting name. The world's largest bullet. Let me just think about how I gotta get over here. It's all the way up there. You could probably just take this road. Fun fact, that is the world's largest bullet right there, according to this game. Should be able to see the prison now. It used to be an island in the ancient sea. Now it's Mr. Shank's own personal male stabbing machine. That's what she said. High five! Good. Nobody? <clears throat> oh, yeah. Looking for an outcropping west of the palace. That's going to be your ticket in. It's pretty easy to find. Oh, what the heck? I gotta jump into it? Found well, hubby number wild. one's house. I always thought his roof would make a great stunt ramp. Time to find out. It's showtime. Oh boy. Oh yeah. When you get inside the walls, find an echo transmitter so I know you made it. Wasn't too bad. You woke the wrong dog. No, I'm just kidding. That would be crazy if two toes or whatever. Nine toes? Nine nine toes, yeah. That'd be crazy if nine toes was back in here. Die! Nerd. Let's see if there's anything else here. Doesn't look like it. Basically, now we gotta go in here. You made it! I bet those oh, bitches go weren't kill expecting Mr. you to Shank. land on that. What an interesting name. Okay. In the I'm sure Mr. Shank palace. is holding Here, your girl Mr. in one Shank, of those I'm cell gonna blocks. Shank you, boy. 